a Greensboro woman, she's frustrated and she's upset tonight after an early morning wake up call from police. You see, the officers knocked on her door telling her someone had shot up her car overnight. As WFMY News 2's Jalen Gilkey explains, she wasn't the only one in that situation. Daria Daniels wasn't the only resident of Stone Throw Apartments whose car was riddled with bullets. Earlier today, I saw at least four cars with bullet holes, and it was clear by the broken glass scattered across the parking lot there were even more. 13 gunshots in the back of my car, okay? Needless to say, I'm devastated. Around 11 p.m. last night, shots rang out in the Stone Throw Apartment complex. I heard uh, two sets of five shots, very loud and very clear to the, to the point where I rolled over on the opposite side of my bed to the floor to protect myself from my sliding glass door. According to Greensboro Police, no one was hurt during last night's shooting, but the dozens of bullet holes left behind tell a different story. Life is very fragile right now, folks, not only because of what has happened to me, but what's going on around this whole world is pay attention to your surroundings, okay? Because sometimes we get so caught up in our everyday worlds, you know, we get out the car and harm may be waiting right outside your car door. As of right now, Greensboro police have not released any additional information, including about suspects.